everybody. Oh, I hope you all can hear me. Hold on. Let me do a little voice check. Okay. Hey everyone, it's Jesus Woman here, back with Glitch Girl. All right, so I haven't made a video and episode for a very long time. There's no specific like date on like I won't be, I won't say that I'm gonna post it every week or every month. It's just when I post it, I'm gonna post it. So I'm not making it up. So this is what I'm doing. I'm continuing from where I left off. And I left off on episode four. I did three episodes and I'm hoping to make this episode a little bit shorter, but here I, here I go. By the way, before I start, <laughs> I already said this, but I'm Jesus Woman, AKA Amanda Weeks, AKA Amanda Weeks Jr. And my mother is also a part of Jesus Woman. We're a duo. And her name is also Amanda Weeks. So AKA Amanda Weeks Sr. You can find us on Facebook, YouTube, and TikTok. And also we have a website that I posted on our YouTube. If you go into the information section, you should be able to find it. So, and if you hear any like baby noises or like do, 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 like music, baby music. By the way, I have a nephew and he's at my house right now. So he's baby nephew, almost four months. So that's, that's that. <laughs> but here I go. All right, Glitch Girl. Little recap. So there's a lot of like, if you didn't see like if what happened and sorry it might be a little bit glitchy if you didn't see what happened um like if you can't remember um i suggest going back to the three videos i have and then coming back to them all right so this is a little summary of what's going to be happening in this episode your powers have been revealed it's up to you to step up and save the city from zero's wrath do you have the courage and the skill you won't believe what happens at the end read out to find out Read now to find out. Okay. I'm just gonna watch the ad. Oh. Another ad. Okay, Glitch Girl. All right, I take it back. I don't know if that was a summary of this episode. It might just be like a summary of the show in general, but here I go. Episode four, the announcement. That's me, by the way. I'm Grace inside of this. Superpowers. What are you talking about? Were you ever exposed to radiation of any kind? Okay, so that summary that I read before I started, this is definitely just a summary of the show itself, not the specific episode. So we gotta find out what's gonna happen today. Were you ever in an accident or explosion? Yes, I was in a, what? Yes, I was in the electro bit explosion. Grace, it all makes sense. What does? Didn't you tell me that your TV has been glitching up? That all the electronic devices in your apartment have been acting strange? Yeah. How long has that stuff been happening? For about two years. Oh my gosh. This is why Zero didn't show up at your place when you saw all those zeros on your phone. We just seen the creepy message on, we had just seen the creepy message on TV. It was obvious on your mind. Oh, I'm sorry. It was obviously on your mind. By worrying about the numbers changing, you caused it to happen. My girl got powers. My girl got powers. I like that. He's right. Please explain it to me. Zero wanted to control the blue droids, but they had robust anti-hacking technology built in. The bomb damaged the blue droids just enough that the anti-hacking technology failed and Zero took control. Oh, Zero must have had his fingerprints all over that bomb. And when it went off, all, all it took was a little bit of sharp, sharpan, sharpan with his DNA on it to get embedded into you. Okay, 
So I got this power from something else. But my girl got powers. I like that. And you and Zero now have the same superpower. Oh, oh, so we equal now. Don't mess with me. We equal now. Don't mess with me. This is insane. By the way, when I say we equal, I'm talking about me and this evil serial guy now have equal strength in the same power. So if you want to, if you want to mess with me, as much strength as he used to punch me, I'm gonna use that same strength to punch him. So you don't want none of this. What's more insane is that Zero likely has no idea that he created someone as powerful as him. Grace. You have the power to take control of the blue droids and stop them from killing. I'll never be able to control off the blue droids at once. By the way, I'm sorry for like the green outline. When I started this again, it gave me green outline. I don't know why. So I just, I apologize. And if I stop a few, zero will keep coming. Um, zero will keep them coming. To truly stop this madness, we need to cut off the head of the serpent. We have to find out exactly who Zero is and where he's hiding. You're right. Did you see the face underneath that hood? No, I didn't see him properly. But Corey did. The only problem is I've searched everywhere for Corey online and I can't find him. Grace, don't you see? You have the ability to manipulate all electronic devices and computers. You can use your power to locate him. I could, I could. You know, I think I'm pretty cool. You think I'm, I think I'm pretty cool. High five. Okay. Why is he back at my house? Like, I don't even know you, okay. So how do we do this thing? Just picture Koi in your mind and see if you can pull any data from the web. It's data, I keep saying data, data. Corey, oh yeah, so the guy right there, that's Corey, the one in the middle. I remember him vividly, the way he was looking at me. Why was I so aggressive? The way he was looking, the way he was looking at me with those gorgeous eyes, oh, she has a crush. Grace, what? Your phone lit up. Oh, okay. I think I found something. That's him. Go ahead, send him a message. What should I say? Okay, nice. We're getting to a choice here. It's Grace from the Electro Bit event. Corey, I found you at last. That is a really good question, okay. What to do? What should I say? Hi, Corey, it's Grace. You know, it's really not that <laughs> I'm making everything so complicated, it's not that complicated. Okay, so I think I'm gonna say, hi, Corey, it's Grace from the Electrobit event, because I don't want to sound like too enthusiastic. Mm. Is that the right word? I don't want to sound too like energetic, like, Corey, I found you at last. Like, I don't want to, and I don't want to sound like creepy. It's not creepy, but I don't want to like startle him, like, because we don't know each other. If anything, it was just a crush and I don't want to make it sound like, I don't know. I just don't, I don't want to seem too eager. It's not creepy. I just don't want to seem too eager. So I'm going to say, hi, Corey. It's Grace from the Electro Bit event. Hi, Corey. It's Grace from the Electro Bit event. I'd love to talk if you have time. He's not responding. Well, I mean, you just sent it. So gotta give it a few minutes, him a few minutes. Grace, it's been two seconds, that's what I'm saying. That's cool though. You're right, I, I do that. I do the same thing sometimes, like if I send a text and I'm like, oh, my brother's not responding, my sister's not responding. I'm like, okay, leave. you just sent it. Gotta give them time to look at it first. Okay. You're right. I should be patient. Well, oh, while we wait, 
we should come up with a plan to stop the blue droids. There are blue droids all over the city. How am I going to save everyone at the same time? I may have a solution to that problem. I should give him a deep voice. I just need a couple more days. A couple? Dude, smart. Two days later. Seth's, 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 mother, mother, how do you say S-E-T-H? Thank you, <laughs> Seth, Seth's house. This place is huge, I know, right? I'd love to give you a tour, but... We should go straight to the basement lab. No, no, give me a tour. Basement lab? You don't have a lab in your basement? No. I mean, that's a cool place to have it. I just, not sciencey, I'm not a sciencey person, science, sciencey person. Um, I don't have, uh, I mean, I don't have a basement. I, honestly, if I was in a house, I wouldn't like if I was in a house, right? I if I had like if I like went and purchased a house, I wouldn't purchase one that had a basement because basements creep creep me out. Cause you know, at nighttime, if you walk down there, it's all dark, creepy. So <laughs> same with an attic. So yeah. Just give me a storage room, not not a basement. Like, <laughs> but you know, maybe. Maybe it could be good. Maybe it doesn't. I don't know. I feel like it kind of creeps me out. I don't know. No, just no. Okay. The invention I've been building is finally safe and working. What on earth is it? Ooh, she has a cute outfit. Here, let me stick this little device in your pocket. Okay, hold up. What is this little device? Is it a tracking device? Is it a bomb? Did he just, I'm sorry, did he just kiss her on the cheek? Do you all see that? I wish I could rewind, can I rewind? No, did you see that? Okay, okay, maybe they just had to animate it. Maybe the person just had to animate it that way so that it looks like he's putting something in her pocket. It just looks like he kissed her on the cheek. I'm not trying to overreact. Just think that's a little too fast. But now think of a place, any place in the world. The Bahamas. Um, okay, I've always wanted to go to Tokyo. I don't know if I still wanna go, but I'm practicing Japanese, if you all don't know. So um, let me speak a little Japanese. I don't know if the pronunciation's right, I'm still a beginner, but. Um, konnichiwa, Amanda to moshimasu. Um, 15歳 desu. Watashi no oko, no, watashi no wa. Oh my gosh, that's wrong. I'm sorry, forgive me. Watashi no okasan no namae wa Amanda desu. Okay. For any mistakes that I've made in that language that I'm speaking, I'm still practicing. Okay. Okay. Um, let's see. So where do I want to go? Paris. Oh my gosh. Paris. Lovely. Cairo. I don't know where that is. The Maldives, I have no idea. So I'm gonna choose out of Tokyo and Paris. I do wanna go, I, mm, I might wanna go to Paris, I don't know. But I definitely did wanna go to Tokyo. Tokyo. So, but I kinda wanna do Paris now. Dang, okay. I'm just gonna go with, I feel my heart is saying Paris, but my mind is saying Tokyo. So I'm gonna say, Tokyo.
nice. Nice. I'm actually in Tokyo. What the heck? Okay, take me back. Seth's ba basement. Oh, shoot, teleportation. Have fun. Seth, this is incredible. This will allow you to teleport immediately to anywhere that there's trouble. Grace, you're going to be the new Vork su new superhero. It's not what I asked for, but okay. Being a superhero is a lot. It can be so depressing and so rewarding at the same time. So I don't really know if I would want to be a superhero. But it would be cool because I get to save people. And I get to have powers. And I get to have powers. So it would be really cool because I get to have powers. The coolest thing is powers. <laughs> but saving people too. Hey, kicking crime, you know what I'm saying? Okay. Um, but you told me you wanted to be New Vork's new hero. New Vork? New York? Wait, why does it have to be just me? What do you mean? With your inventions and my supernatural ability, we can be a team. There's a reason it was Ultiman and Extra Woman. Grace, this, don't say no. I'm not saying no, this is my dream come true. This is everything I've ever wanted. You're everything I've ever wanted. I hope he's saying that as like in a friend way or like in a superhero way. I don't know what's come over me, but I just want to kiss him right now. <laughs> Wait, slow your roll. Wait, hold up, wait a minute. I would not act like this. They said in this game, you get to control how you play the game, the outcomes. They said you can make your choices. Okay. But my true character is not like this, like in real life. Like I wouldn't, I wouldn't trust him this easily, this quickly. And I wouldn't feel like, I wouldn't want to kiss him so soon. I don't know him. Yeah, he's been nice to me so far, but is there more than what he's showing me in his character? Is he two-faced? Is he a wolf in sheep clothing? I don't know. I would like to find out before, you know, making the next step to say, hey, I think we should pursue this into a romantic relationship. But honestly, she's not, okay, let me count. She's only known him for about two to three days. Okay, I'm gonna make a part two. I'm really starting to fall for him. Should I tell him I feel fall? She doesn't know him. Don't kiss Seth and keep your feelings to yep, yeah, keep your feelings to yourself. Um, I didn't mean to say it like that. <laughs> um, with my inventions and your superpowers will be unstoppable. All we need now are superhero names. Let's choose yours first. What should my superhero name be? The Pink Puma? Goodness Grace, Gracious Grace? What? Okay, that's fine. <laughs> Goodness Gracious Grace. <laughs> um, how about we think of something else? Wait, <clears throat> I've got the perfect one. I can glitch electric devices, right? How about Glitch Girl? That's that's better. I would say Glitch Woman, but that's better. It sounds a bit childish. No, it doesn't. Childish? I've got a better idea. How about Energy Woman? Oh, that's a good one. I love it. I prefer Glitch Girl. Honestly, Glitch Girl sounds good. Energy Woman, though, the woman part. The woman part. But I'm going to stick with 
No, I'm gonna do energy woman. I don't know. I love it. Awesome. And I can be electroman. Okay. Because I invent electrical things. Does that make sense? Energy woman and electroman. <clears throat> I mean, energy woman and electroman. It's perfect. But we can't just start saving people. We'll need to introduce ourselves to the world. How about I book City Hall's next available slot? Oh man, what am I gonna wear? I should probably wear a suit or a tie or something. Grace, you're energy woman. The only choice you need to make is color, color scheme. Oh, let me fix the camera a little bit. Oh, ah, okay. What are you talking about? You think the teleporter was the only thing I've been working on these last couple of days? I can't, I almost, uh, how am I supposed to know? I proudly present to you your very own custom made superhero outfit. Nice. That purple one really catches my eye. Wow. There's an E on it and everything. I told you I've been thinking about the same. Which one would you like? I want to try them on. I would say I want to try, I want, okay. Let's just try them on. Cause I want you all, I want to try them on. I want you all to see, even though I have a little bit of time before it starts again, I'm just going to make a part two if I can't continue and just post them today or tomorrow or later. I don't know, but I will eventually post them. What color would you like to try? Let's do red first. Oh, that's cute. Let's try a different color. Let's do purple. Okay. Let's do till. Ah, no, like, okay, I'm doing till. I, I, I think with, last time I played this, I went with purple. So I'm gonna do till this time. It's so crazy. I was hoping you'd pick up that color. That's my favorite too. Okay. I'd better get matching a matching one for me. Can we just like two <clears throat> days later? <coughs> Excuse me. New Vork City Hall. Oh, they look awesome. There's no need to be nervous, Grace. They're gonna love you. Yeah. I thanks would have been nice, but okay. Thanks, yeah, thanks. Okay. Hey, stop with the noise and make it a video. Construction ruffles. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm Grace and this is Seth. I'm Energy Woman and this is Electro Man. Knock, knock. I'm, I'm going to say this because I don't want them to know my actual name. I'm Energy Woman and this is Electro Man. Otherwise known as, she said it anyways. Thank you, Grace. Grace and Seth. It's okay. Seth is an inventor and I have superpowers. What superpowers? Why you gotta be so aggressive? He's like, what superpowers? I can control electric devices at will. Isn't that what Zero can do? Oh goodness. Yes, it's exactly what Zero can do. She is zero. Why would I come and reveal myself if I was zero? I'm not zero, but I understand her fright. I understand because they don't even know who this person is. So if I have powers as him, they would suspect that it's me. But like, why would I, re I wouldn't come and reveal myself. Okay, everybody run. Ah, uh, no, I'm not zero. I gained his powers during the electro bit explosion. Don't believe her, she's evil, just like him. What, because I have powers? It's kind of, dang, it's a little harsh. Grace is nothing of, that, of the sort. We're here to announce ourselves as your superheroes. We're going to take over from Ultiman and Actual. But we can't replace them, but we're new superheroes to save the city. I'll believe it when I see you save someone. 
Okay, all right, that makes sense. You gotta earn the trust, right? Are you people dumb? What the city desperately needs right now is a new set of, new, of superheroes. Oh, oh, thank you. I believe in Grace and Seth, thank you. And if you want to survive on Zero's onslaught, you should believe them too. Thank you. You have my support. Sit down, woman. How do we even know they're telling the truth? Show us your powers. Oh my God, I'm so crazy. Um, what should I? What should I show them? Wait, wait, what? How should I show them what I can do? Make their phones glitch. Make the lights flicker. Make the aircon go wild. See, if I make their phones glitch and then and then it breaks, then I'm gonna have to pay for all that, and I don't got that type of money. Make the lights flicker. Same thing. Aircon go wild. Hmm. I'm just gonna say, make the phones glitch. Cause if I make the lights flicker, they might be like, oh, there's just someone in the back doing this to the light switch. So I just make their phones glitch. Okay, let's see if I can do this. Focus, Grace, focus. What's happening to my phone? It's going crazy. Calling mom? No, I don't wanna call my mom. Wait. Mine too? It's taking hundreds of selfies and posting them. Stop. That's my worst angle. Okay, maybe that wasn't the best idea. Maybe I should have just made the lights flicker. Using my mind, I've made all of your phones glitch. She really does have superpowers. Okay, make it stop. I don't know how to get them back under control. I knew it wasn't a good idea. Ah. Grace, I can hear a phone buzzing. I know, Seth, I'm trying to fix it. No, I think it's your phone. Oh. Grace, I just saw the message. Corey, I can't believe we found each other. Okay, so I'm gonna end it here and make part two. Bye.